This is our feature. Athens County Antique Machinery Show, September 29, 2012. There's going to be no competition. The International 1070 Hydro. I couldn't. I couldn't walk that slow. The John Deere B was the winner of the first heat. The Cockshut was the winner of the second heat. And the International won the third heat. But there will be no competition. The John Deere beat its competitors by a long way. The Cockshut beat its competition by quite a bit. There was no competition with that International. <laughs> that International Hydro, it runs so slow and the engine will idle down so low. There's just absolutely no competition there. <laughs> He's not a tractor's length off the line. And the, bee, the bee's already at halfway. So we know between the PDA Internationals even run wide open now. <laughs> he's running wide open and he's still going to smoke. So. John Deere Beasley B is easily going to be out first. Here's the finish line. He is now considered out of the competition. You can hear the international revving up, and he still hasn't, hasn't even come close. <laughs> Cochettas. The engine's running perfect because it's running such a low RPM. It's still making the tractor go. But you just can't beat that hydro. He's even goosing the hydro to bring her up. So I don't run out of film. <laughs> Cockshut's now crossed the line. And the International. If he hadn't brought the RPMs to up to two thirds and power shifted to four or five times, he would have never lost. International 1070 Hydra. Winner by.